Yeah, because of the wind, I'm going to try not to talk so much, so you get special treatment. I'll shut up. Do ha I do have a special club that I'm trying out. This is a 60 degree alien wedge. I have it 56 that I used, used to use a lot. And I think I've used this maybe once in the video. But I uh, really didn't need it. So I haven't used it since. So, so it's almost like it's brand new. Anyway, so I'm out here playing with that to see what it's like. See, I just like to get out with my clubs that I haven't used in a while sometimes and play with them. And uh, need to sell some of them. I'll top that out of here, this fairway. Typical if the ball's not sitting up. Doesn't matter what club I got. And this wind, that was a well hit ball on that drive. And that wind just held it up. Had a balloon on me. I could have probably teed it down some, hit it low, but hit more like a stinger, but I'm not really good at those, so anyway. I'm gonna blame that one on the wind too. <laughs> I hit it good, it's not far enough. Well, I had a terrible second shot. It compensated for the, the wind blowing side, uh, you know, that way. And, uh, <laughs> but my third shot was great. And then I missed the putt, of course. But that 60 degree worked pretty good there. Probably shouldn't hit this 60 here, but what the heck. I missed a green. Drew it, overdrew it. So that Alien Roswell wedge, the 60 degree works pretty good actually. I thought it was gonna hit that long. It popped it up in the air. So, not bad. If I'd give it a, just a little bit more, I might have had a better chance for par. That's just a terrible putt. That was another well struck drive, and I think the wind helped me. I'm playing with the wind on that on this hole five. But it went pretty high in the air. And I, what I was trying to do is hit more of a fade or sh shot instead of draw. So that's what I set up for. But 
faded it a little bit, but the wind, I mean, it carried it mostly. But uh, I'll take it. Well, that was a lip out like Wyndham Clark. Again, I hit another nice little chip shot, and it's off of uh, the, pretty much the dirt. So, at 60 degree, works pretty good. You, you know, it's got a fat uh, sole to it. A wide sole, I shouldn't say fat. <laughs> That's not very political correct of me. Anyway, so it's got a wide sole, and it's got these little fins. I don't know if they do anything. I know I've done the 56, featured 56 on here, and it's got the, you know, if it didn't have all this junk on it, maybe if it's just a regular looking club, more people, it would appeal more to more people. But it's kind of like one of those seen on TV, maybe uh, on the Golf Channel or something, you know, where they're trying to pitch it all the time. But it's really reasonably priced. You go to rock bottom dot, uh, rockbottomgolf.com and you'll find them for probably under 40 bucks I think but uh, I'll leave a link in, in the description to that one on rock bottom I don't get anything off of it but just something you know playing around with but not that I don't hit my 60 my 60 my 58 I got a 58 decently around the greens but anyway that's all I got thanks for watching we'll see you later